Well, new details tonight about the weekend crash that killed five people from the same family. We've learned the driver of the converted semi-trailer was a brother and a pro motocross hopeful. Amy Holly has the story. Well, the Kansas Highway Patrol says Minnesota teenager Adam Kerber was driving the converted semi-trailer when it lost control, broke through a guardrail on I-35, and then rolled into a rocky ravine Sunday morning near Williamsburg, Kansas. Eighteen people were in the vehicle at the time of the crash. It was converted into a living quarters. Four of them inside were the 17-year-old driver's brothers and sisters and his sister-in-law. Many of the 13 others injured were family members, and as you can see here, the family's Facebook memorial page has been flooded with photos and prayers all day long. Adam and his mother Pauline are still the only two in critical condition tonight. They were on their way back from a Texas motocross spring break vacation. Their Minnesota neighbors say Adam is a pro motocross hopeful who has hundreds of trophies. Neighbors in their close-knit rural town in Minnesota say news about the family of 12 spread quickly. Calls and said you're not going to like the news. And I said, I don't want bad news. He says, I I can't tell you. All I can tell you was your girl's died. The widowed mother of 12, Pauline Kerber, released this statement tonight. I will deeply miss my four children and daughter-in-law. However, we take comfort knowing that they are with their father who passed away in 2006. Neighbors say it was their father's dying wish to travel to motocross events together with the family. They were trying to fulfill that dream and hope to put their son on the pro motocross circuit. The High Kansas Highway Patrol is still trying to figure out, though, why that son lost control of the vehicle with so many people inside. Amy Holly, 41 Action News.